Thank you very much. Uh, it's an opportunity for me uh, before the, the UN commemoration day. I'm getting the opportunity to answer your question. Thank you very much. Basically, you know, Bangladesh is one of the highest troops contributing country. For the world peace, Bangladesh is sending their troops. Okay? So this is also an opportunity for Bangladesh that they are taking part actively in establishing peace in Democratic Republic of Congo. So, uh, and you know, from Bangladesh I have been selected and I have been sent here to work as a Northern Sector Commander. So somehow I have got also the previous experience also. I work in Sierra Leone uh, for establishing peace. I have worked in also the Sudan, which is for Darfur. We call it Inami. There I was also a Contingent Commander. And now I have been selected as the Sector Commander. That thereby somehow the, the, the UN asked for a Sector Commander from the country and the country has selected me. As I have also the experience of working in Blue Helmet, actually that has helped me rather to work here. Thank you. Yes, this is the first time I am serving in Democratic Republic of Congo. Though I have the experience before I two times working under Blue Helmet, but for working in Ituri, this is the first time. Basically, the UN has a mandate on which you are working, okay? And you must be knowing in the troublesome area, entire Monosco has got four sectors. Three sectors along with the FIB sector. The southern sector, central sector, northern sector. Uh, I'm appointed as the northern sector commander. So here we are working to uplift the mandate. In the mandate, if I say that we are working with highest priority, with the number one, that is the protection of the civilian. You know, in the troublesome area to ensure the protection of the civilian, we are working day and night. And from uh, in the northern sector, we have got number of battalion. We have got Bangladesh Rapid Development Battalion. We have got Nepal Battalion. All are going out, going for patrolling, going for the civic action, going for the uh, and development action, and, and quick impact project. And also, they are working for the winning hearts and minds project. So, thereby, we are trying to ensure the protection of the civilian. And beside the number one priority, we are also working uh, for the enhancement of the government's machinery. So that, so that in terms of crisis or the in absence of Monosco, the government machinery can take over and can work for the country. Here many times we are ensuring the uh, training for the FRDC and PNC, I mean the National Congress Police. Here we are also working for the infrastructure development like the road construction, breeze, culvert construction and also the establishing some school where we are providing stationery and other thing to the school so that it really help the or it really enhance the overall development of the country for providing or the ensuring the protection of the civilian beside the normal patrolling we are sometimes even going for the targeted operation so to evict the armed groups from this area You must be knowing uh, Congo is a wonderful country and the nation is the wonderful nation having a lot of potentiality to be developed. It is having the highest, second largest the, the mineral resources and other things. For the communal conflict as the, the various groups or the faction are fighting each other, they are not getting the benefit out of the resources and other things. As the Monosco forces are dominating the area, they are trying to evict the armed group from the area of responsibility. So somehow it is ensuring the peace for the people. Thereby I am happy to say the area of responsibility which I possess from that area as the armed groups are being evicted. So normal people, normal population, they can go for work. Students can go to the school and people are go, go there for day to day commodity. They can go to the market and other things. They were slowly, gradually, actually we are going to win the hearts and minds of the people. Even out of five provinces in the RO, in the Mahagi, there is no problem. And killing incident day by day, it is reducing. As FRDC and the Monosco force are working together with a good tie, so we are able to develop the situation. We are trying to motivate the people, we are trying to motivate the, the various community, various fashion. If they understand that fighting is not bringing any development, slowly, gradually, I am sure there will be no killing, there will be no odd incident and people will really be happy and peace will be ensured. So as Monosco force, we are not going to work for ourselves. Being far away from my country, I have come here, I'm giving time, I'm giving my labor to establish peace. So slowly, gradually, I'm sure people are also understanding 
and in near future they will be benefited. I'm sure that other than the arm group people, those who are getting the arms, the general mass are very happy on the monoscope. You know the difficulties or the challenges many. Okay, the 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 monoscope force as a northern sector commander, the amount of force are with me. It is very meager in comparison to the vast area I am covering. Terrain is very difficult. The road condition is not that good. So even after giving, getting an alert or getting the way we respond, the road condition and other things does not suitable or is not suitable or does not help us. And, and there are a number of people are living together. Every individual has got separate opinion. And all the groups are having their own armed groups. As they fight each other, sometimes it is very difficult to make all the groups together on one table and make them understand that fighting is not that good. Sometimes it is happening that each armed groups has got their own agenda. They do not try to listen to others. The bringing them in one chair and making them understand is also a very difficult task. Even after having, despite having a lot of challenges, I am happy that the government machinery, especially the FRDC, PNC, are trying to help us. Government has got good intention. Hopefully, the, all the challenges will be able to overcome. But here, I like to once say one thing: being far away, people from Bangladesh, Nepal, Morocco, and other countries have come here to help these Congolese people. Okay? Actually, there is no benefit of ours. But even having the lot of resources, vast opportunity. People are not understanding. If they understand, the fighting is not that good. If they work together on the Congolese, Congolese is a great nation, is a, is a very, very talented and brilliant nation. If the people work together, I'm sure the peace is not that far. Okay? And Monoski is working here just to help them, just as aid. If they understand how, what we are trying to do, and by combination of this both, I'm sure we can really bring the peace in the near future. Thank you very much for giving me opportunity to talk.